tonight at 10, Huntsville City Schools is working on a plan to find the best way to handle growth in the Hampton Cove area, which could include building a new high school. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Naja Sherman. Dan Schaefer has the evening off. Way 31's Cody Fisher is live in Owens Crossroads after tonight's meeting between parents and the school district. Cody, what did you learn? Nasha, the roughly 80 parents who walked through these doors here at Goldsmith Schiffman Elementary were part of a group that answered a survey from the civic organization here in Hampton Cove. Now, that survey showed that more than 80% of those parents are concerned about growth in the area. Now, as those parents were walking out of these doors tonight, some of them were not happy with the answers that they did not get here during the meeting. Cassie Parsons has a son entering kindergarten. Her main concern is growth on this side of the mountain and if there will be a high school built to accommodate the growth. I would love it at some point, you know, especially with my son just coming in. I would love the fact that he doesn't have to drive over the mountain. Superintendent Christy Finley's presentation focused on broad goals in the district and not specifics. She told me they don't know if the district will build a new high school here or not because the district is still evaluating all of the growth in Huntsville. And there's growth on the northwest side of town, on the north side of town, on the east side of town. So we constantly monitor enrollment to see what the needs are everywhere. Right now, Finley is focusing on improving reading and math skills in the district, retaining teachers, and recruiting the best teachers from colleges in the area. They're producing some quality candidates, and we want to get them before they go outside of our state. Parsons likes the district, making the quality of teachers a priority. She just wanted more substantial answers about how the district plans on tackling the short term and long term growth in the area. Those are the things I would have really liked answered, but I, but I understand and respect the fact that the board has to talk about it and there's a process to go behind that. Now, Superintendent Krista Finley told me that the district is actively working on a plan to handle all of the growth that the people here at the elementary school were worried about tonight. And she says the district plans on presenting those plans at the September Board of Education meeting. Reporting live in Owens Crossroads, Cody Fisher, Way 31 News.